Yo, yo, yo. This is Stars with Magic, where we talk about the stars with magic. Speaking of stars, look at that giant star right behind me. Anyway. All right. If you're wondering, I actually live in Southern California, a.k.a. San Diego. Anyway, okay. Today we're talking about that Capricorn woman. All right. Let's just start off by saying the Capricorn woman is sexy. Like the Scorpio woman, the Capricorn woman has this earthiness, this solid, grounded lustiness to her personality. Okay. For the most part, she's not very demonstrative right if she's feeling sexy if she's looking sexy whatever for the most part you'll see that she is dressed conservatively all right capricorn is usually dressed conservatively meaning everything is covered okay they might um you know the capricorn woman she might be um dressed very provocatively but essentially everything will be covered okay the Capricorn woman is also, like the Scorpio woman, very strategic. And she definitely knows how to climb the ladder of success, right? You know, or climb the mountain, so to speak. Um, because Capricorn is symbolized by the goat, right? The goat, I don't know if you know this, but mountain goats, and I guess maybe other types of goats, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> they climb the mountain, climb mountains. In ways that you would never expect okay they'll find the tiniest little little surface step on it and hoist themselves up to that next level right and you know Capricorn in every way does this as well okay sometimes you'll even find that the Capricorn woman is found um, a major like achieved or accomplished major feats at young at a young age right so the capricorn woman might somehow find herself into an area of life where she's like writing laws right but she might not even be 21 years old yet okay you'll see the capricorn woman doing things accomplishing things that other people could only dream about doing because number one the capricorn woman is not very expressive right she holds everything within and she's very serious why i want to say it's the the she doesn't have a desire to be vulnerable okay so she holds it all in and what this will end up doing will it will prompt and make other people think wow she's very mature you know wow she she has her head on right you know what i mean she's very she's wise beyond her years um, I want to give her this opportunity because there's so much potential there, right? She has the mindset. She has the, 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 the discipline, right? She's disciplined. And you'll find that she is just automatically successful because people want to give it to her, okay? People want to give resources to the Capricorn because she doesn't portray herself in a in an irresponsible kind of way you know if she's feeling angry depends on the moon sign right want to look at the moon um because let's say you have a moon in aries a capricorn woman you know she might she might react first and and regret it later okay so even though she can be self-controlled and disciplined you want to look at the moon sign and what's aspecting the moon to see like really where her head is at okay but essentially the the capricorn woman is very she knows how to work okay she is hard working she can work for long periods of time shift after shift um you know if you want a project to be completed contact a capricorn woman but if you're looking to have fun and be free and feel alive and go on adventures 
the Capricorn woman is really not she doesn't think about those things right she doesn't really think about oh let me go and try the new you know trendy this new restaurant she might if that's a part of her career she might if she knows that you know people of status are going to be there and you know the people that she wants to meet and work with are going to be there she'll go but just for fun just for the the sake of trying something new she might not really care to do that you know she might she there's got to be a good reason for the capricorn woman to do something that somebody else suggests right the capricorn woman if you tell her oh you should go do this oh this sounds like a good idea if she has moon in pisces she might you know it might be really easy to suggest things to her and she might you know be willing to try those things right but if she has let's say moon and aquarius she's really not going to care about taking your advice listening to your input doing anything that has to do with what you think she should do all right the capricorn woman truly has her own she has her head on right and she knows what she wants at a very early age okay the capricorn woman is very uh she's reserved emotionally um because of the vulnerability aspect you know when it comes to um expressing your feelings you know sometimes you have to um like let's say if you're really happy about something expressing that joy believe it or not makes you a little bit vulnerable right because let's say you're having a great time you're so excited blah 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 and you're telling your friend like oh my god i just met this guy or you know let's say the capricorn woman just met a guy that she's really into she won't go running and tell her friend about him because she knows that she could end up looking stupid if it doesn't work out or she knows that you know her friend might bring her back down to earth and say what are you thinking you just met this guy you know the capricorn woman already knows what harsh reality is okay capricorn represents maturity as a bee just came and visited my kombucha forgot what i was gonna say whoops <laughs> um the capricorn woman is um she i, I don't know where i want to go after this forgot what i was gonna say dang it b you distracted me anyways um basically you know the capricorn woman she she knows though that she needs to loosen up right most capricorn individuals know that they are a little uptight oh yeah capricorn is for the most part associated with reality harsh reality um think saturn okay saturn is the grandfather that's like 105 years old and he's super serious doesn't like to joke around you know if you say too much around him he will tell you to be quiet you know what i mean like the the capricorn energy is very very heavy okay so the capricorn woman is not it's a little bit hard for her to get into her feminine energy because of the fact that feminine energy has to be playful feminine energy has to be relaxed feminine energy has to be um a little bit dreamy okay feminine energy is a little bit dreamy and so the capricorn woman feels very uh out of place you know she feels very like you know how do i how do i express what i'm feeling right now she probably won't you know um yeah so let's get on to the ambition the ambitious nature of capricorn let me take a bite of my salad hello.
she's very ambitious. The Capricorn woman can find herself having multiple jobs early on in life. Why? Because she likes to make money. <laughs> the Capricorn woman likes to make money. By the way, I'm not Capricorn. I'm Taurus. Um, but I have a lot of Capricorn energy in my family. Not in my... Well, yeah, actually. Anyways. Um, and I want to say that having a Capricorn sun sign uncle has allowed me to see that Capricorn sun sign individuals stop themselves from expressing their feelings all the time. Okay. Um, the Capricorn, and I know I was going into the ambition. I'll get back to that. Capricorn um, will have feelings, right? And it's almost like their inner parent never stops. Okay. You know, that, that part of you that's always saying, like pointing out the negative, pointing out the barriers, pointing out what makes things difficult right it's like the the opposite of dreaminess right the opposite of a dream is harsh reality okay so when it comes to expressing joy when it comes to expressing sadness the capricorn woman will find herself listening to the voice inside her mind that tells her stop crying you know uh crying's not gonna do anything for you or stop laughing why are you so happy um and then remind her of the negative right you find that people with a lot of capricorn energy in their chart they struggle with depression they struggle with depression because of the the amount of pressure they put on themselves to achieve accomplish and acquire great things and when they don't, you know, have, like, you know, conquer, 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 when they're not always the winner, you know, it gets to them. It crushes them, right? They can be so hard on themselves, all right? Capricorn women really deserve so much good in life, but because of the fact that their inner reality can be so harsh, it drives people away, right? It makes them impatient with people. It makes them, you know, put up walls where there should be none, right? The Capricorn woman struggles so much in life because of her, her, the fear of rejection, the fear of criticism. It's fear, essentially. And why is the Capricorn woman so afraid? Because she's so deeply sensitive, all right? I feel like the best thing that I could say for a Capricorn woman, whoops, I don't know if you saw that, I spit a little bit. <laughs> um, my advice for a Capricorn woman is to accept yourself, okay? Yes, love yourself, but the core of loving yourself is accepting yourself, okay? realizing that you're sensitive and that's okay that's even a beautiful thing you know what i mean people all everybody